Right, welcome back everyone. So today in this video, I'm gonna show you how to use um, Microsoft Excel to create a pivot table for a data set. So basically we try to obtain the summary of a data set. Right, so the data set we use called Universal Bank and we try to calculate um, some criteria in order to determine if a uh, uh, number of customer gonna receive or accept the loan or not. Okay, so uh, the first step we're gonna uh, partition the data into two subset uh, training and validation. So we do partition, we select all the variables with the percentage of 60 and 40. Okay, right? Um, so once you have the partition data, we're gonna select the training data and we're using the insert right here to create the pivot table. So we're using the uh, pivot table template right here. Uh, because we already select the uh, training data, so they're going to see the selected data right here. We're going to create a new worksheet for the uh, pivot table. So click OK. So this is a template of the pivot table. So in this pivot table, we try to calculate uh, the probability of a customer to accept the loan uh, given the online and credit card equal one. So with that said, we're going to have the online gonna be a column. Uh, credit card could be a row and a personal loan could be the secondary row. So we have the template, I think. Now the drop value field right here could be the number of records. So we could using ID, that's the values. And here can like change the value field uh, from the sum into count. It means we count how many records uh, satisfy the condition of online and credit card uh, with the personal loan. Click OK. Right, so you can see the uh, summary of the data uh, as we obtain over here. So there are the two important parameters for calculating the probability of personal loan given online credit card. Okay. The number we see in right here can be 522, implying that uh, given the online equal 1 and the uh, credit card equal 1. Uh, the total number of records could be a 522. In 522 right here, we have a 51 of them have the personal loan equal 1, and 571 right here personal equal 0. So in order to calculate, uh, given online equal 1 and uh, credit card equal 1, uh, probability of a customer accept the loan is mean equal to 1, could I equal five, uh, 51 divided by 522. Uh, I think that's it. Uh, very simple in order to calculate based on the summary of the data. Alright, um, I think uh, the other question is pretty the same. Uh, for example, we could uh, do the uh, uh, calculation for the uh, online and personal loan or the uh, personal loan versus credit card. Uh, we do the same. Uh, so the row could be personal loan and the a column could be a credit card or online and the calculation will be the same uh, or the step will be the same all right i think um that's it for uh, today and um please let me know if you have any question all right thank you bye